get the hell out of our states. If you want abortion on demand, please move to California, move to Colorado, right. move to New York, move to Illinois. I don't want to move, move to New to York. Michigan. The economy is so bad, though. Exactly. Well, then don't vote for it here. Enjoy. Don't vote for it here. Leave. Leave now. Constitutional amendment. If you think that there should be, because it's not in there, and that's what the Supreme Court just said, this is not something that is protected by the Constitution of the United States or the amendments. So you can do a constitutional amendment for a right to abortion. Go for it. The bar is really high. What you'll find is you'll never get anywhere Wouldn't close that have to, to be at a convention uh, of the states? Yeah. yeah. So they would have yeah. to go through an entire process. And, and the fact They don't want to do that. They don't want to go through a difficult process. They want to power grab did. through authoritarianism. I know. That's what they said. They said, look, not we're not going to get every single one of these things right. So we're going to leave a mechanism in place to make sure that you can adjust this as you see fit. But it isn't going to be at the whims of nine people. It's not going to be at the whims of Congress. It's going to be a much harder process. The other thing that you can do, get the hell out of our states. If you want abortion on demand, please move to California, move to Colorado, right. move to New York. Move to Illinois. I don't want to move, move to New to York. Michigan. The economy is so bad, though. Exactly. Well, then don't vote for it here. Enjoy. Don't vote for it here. Leave. Leave now. Yes. They act as though the only decision takes place after contraception. There are many decisions before that. Many decisions before that. Let's be clear. There are decisions in how you approach dating or courting, as it used to be known. There are decisions in how you decide on your future mate, partner. There are decisions on whether you want it to be a one-night stand or not, which, by the way, is something that I think is, a, is, is, is very corrosive to our society. Then there are decisions on if you decide that this is the person, whether it's a one-night stand or your significant partner, which form of contraception. Are you using hormonal birth control? There's now male hormonal birth control. I don't know if it's out on the market yet. It's basically just enough testosterone to ruin your boys, but not enough for performance-enhancing benefit. Uh -oh. Wonderful. Mm. Do you want to use a rubber? Hey, when it comes to rubber, what do you want? Do you want ultra-sensitive? Do you want lambskin? Do you want ribbed for her pleasure? You can get a French tickler. Or there's a diaphragm. There's an IUD for some of them, and I know that's a whole different... But my point is, there are many decisions that you make. You know what women can Before also, abortion. Yeah. You know what they can also do? Sorry to interrupt. They can track their ovulation as well. Yeah. That's a very effective way to limit. The it's a somewhat effective way. Well. That's it a is. somewhat effective way. It is. Let's be honest. It's not a very effective way. Tracking ovulation is a very effective way to limit your chances. Yes, to limit your chances. But it's it's it is not a foolproof, foolproof system. No, 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 no. Not at all. But also, especially, especially after a couple of Zimas, <laughs> <laughs> that app isn't getting checked for notifications. Watch Louder with Crowder live, Monday through Thursday, 10 a.m. Eastern.